Hello guys, what's up? Welcome to Trendy Go. Did you know the mixed martial arts star from Dagestan knows six languages? The champion's already gone down in history as one of the world's greatest fighters. He's yet to be defeated, and practically everything is known about him these days. Habib Nurmagomedov is a UFC lightweight champion with a perfect professional career record 29-0. Despite being one of the best UFC fighters at the moment, Habib is not as popular, and there's a lot of interesting facts about him that people don't know. So in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at five facts that are a little lesser known about Habib Nurmagomedov. But before we jump in, please make sure you press that red subscribe button along with the tiny bell icon to enter into our monthly shout out giveaway. All you gotta do is comment down below saying I subscribed and we will enter you into the giveaway. Number five, Habib used to be a fan of Conor McGregor. Nowadays, Habib and the Irish fighter are sworn enemies. Their feud has been going on for several years now, and their fans are still trying to work out who started it first. But this has not always been the case. In 2014, Conor McGregor was a rising UFC star, actively promoted by his managers. At the time, many fell under the Irishman's charm, including Habib, who had already become popular himself. They met through Twitter. Sportswear brand Dethrone was promoting a new t-shirt in which the Irishman was to fight in and asked who else needed one. But both of them declined being friends, and McGregor even went as far as to say that this game is not meant for making friends. Number four, Habib almost became a bouncer in a nightclub. The idea of working as a security guard came to the fighter from Dagestan after two bad injuries in a row. In 2014, he suffered torn cruciate ligaments in his knee, and a year later, in the run-up to a scheduled fight with Tony Ferguson, he broke a rib. Nur Mohamedov wanted to end his career, and in order to continue providing for himself and his family, he was already married, he was already considering a bouncer job to earn money. His father persuaded him against the move and insisted that he would provide for his son. Your job is to eat well and go to the gym, Abdul Manap Nur Mohamedov said. I told Habib at the time that it took us such a long time to get this far, so he should not give up so quickly. He returned to the mat and started to sweat his guts out, and he never stopped, recalls Habib's father. Number three, Habib lost a lot when he was a child. Habib literally grew up on the mat. He started training at the age of five. The boy pursued all types of combat sports, freestyle wrestling, judo, Greco-Roman wrestling, sambo, hand-to-hand -hand combat, pancreation, grappling, and jujitsu. His father entered him in every possible competition, but the boy, as a rule, never won first prize. And then severe fatigue took its toll. At the age of 13 and 14, Habib was winning fifth or sixth place in all the Republic's competitions. Number two, Habib is an economist and knows six languages. Habib received a secondary vocational education. He graduated from the Makhakala Finance and Economics College. Now the 31-year-old athlete is getting a higher education. He's a fourth-year student at the Plekhanov Russian University of Economics. In addition, Habib speaks five languages. Kumik, he has Kumik relatives, his native Avar, Russian, Turkish, and English. He can also read Arabic, but is too shy to speak it yet, according to his father. And number one, training with bears. According to his father, Abdul Manap, he grew up among the students of his wrestling school and as a birthday present, he had to face a chained bear cub. A son always wants to show his father what he's capable of. The fight against the bear was more of a test of character than an exercise, he said, following the criticism he received. All right, that's all for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. Go ahead and share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so. I hope I pronounced everything correctly. All right, with that being said, we'll see you in the next video.